Alright, we're finally back to playing this game. Back to playing Kirby's Epic Yarn. This will also be a bit shorter. And this time I won't try not to mess around this time. Still got that sword. Got a different hat. And I throw bombs. Sweet. Just like Bomberman. Rainbow Ranch. Okay. Mm. Alright, I got another one. Trying to eat me, will ya? That alligator? Eat this. Ow! Festa. There goes all my beads I just collected. Take that. I haven't played this game in like probably a week now, so. Well, probably two weeks now, which feels like it. Alright, so they respawn. Alright, never mind that. Let's just keep going. Come on. Go back. Oh yeah, get more of these. And be richer. Mm. Thanks, buddy. Okay, so using the D-pad makes it go faster. I'm already losing a lot of beads now. Hold on. E bomb, sucker. All right, open the chest. No, 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 grab it. Outdoor bath. Nice. All right, got browse. At the rules, I've been my beads. I might. All right, just gotta be careful. Oh boy, I remember this one. I start surfing up. Double jump, and I missed. Okay, guess you had to do it more than... ...and once. I am missing a lot of these ones. Hmm. Look at that, I am missing so much right now. Mm. 
And I missed it. Well, at least I got silver. I have to redo the stage again. And so I can get gold. Yeah, I know that. We only still got like six and a half minutes left. Like that one pretty quick. I still got plenty of time to do this. So let's see what stage I unlocked. Fake bean vine. Maybe this should not take too long. And I probably won't do the boss battle. Oh, next time I play this game, of course. Alright, we're just gonna try not to lose any more beats this time. Watch where you're aiming! Mm, you little punk. Alright. Careful. Go for a bomb at you. Cause you're a little punk. ASS know it all with those arrows. Not gonna listen to me because he's dead now. Let's see what this does. Okay, it does ice. No, I'm keeping the bomb. Um, it's actually quite useful. Alright, come on. Trying to get that. Come on. Get up there. Trying to be careful here, since he moves so fast. Right back at ya! <laughs> Good, because I said the tile of the show. Eh. Anyhow, let's just focus here. And I missed it. Let me just get this. Jump on these balloons. Take on the weird enemy up there that looks like a duck. I like how the music sounds very nice in this one. In this game, you do have to collect, like, soundtracks. Next, but since we got the internet now, we could just listen to any type of music we want. It's, this game kind of feels like, um... Not only that it's like an epic yarn, but kind of like those other games that you play before that's like a platforming game. Besides, you know, who... Takes on turtles all the time. I know this is a Kirby game, but this reminds me of if you like play with a Zelda without any powers or any of that stuff. Of about dying, it's 
It'd be kind of like that if you had some good skills not to fall down every each time this happens. It kind of reminds me of like Yoshi's Island, and I still keep falling. It's kind of like that game, if you're trying to get to the top without taking damage, without getting hit by enemies. It's kind of like that, being all cutesy and adorable. It's mostly really like that game. It's not dealing with the annoying baby, you know, who crying. It's kind of like that, you know, cute and adorable, and I still keep going too fast. I'm just gonna use the D pad this time. Okay, I like this ability. Just sucks up all the beads up. Of like a vacuum cleaner, but the opposite of it. And down I go. Come on. No, you don't. Get up there. I'm already running out of time here. And I got a cloud pillow. Alright, that's nice. I like how everything's cute and fluffy here. Let me make sure you stay on those balloons. If you stay on there too long, they'll f make you fall. Alright, made it. Alright, come on, please, right on the red one. Yes, come on, come on! Yes! At last, we got gold. Gold metal on that one. <laughs> All right, Hunter presented that stage so well. Also, it's kind of weird that there's no Kirby or Prince, whatever his name is. I already forgot his name already. Aren't dancing to this scene. He just looks exactly like Kirby and Seven God's eyes, like any most characters do. Alright. No, no, no. Throw it right there, Kirby. Alright, gotta make the plant grow. That makes us go up to the first boss stage. The first boss name is. Wait for it. Fangara. Since we're pretty much out of time, I'm about to end it here and see about finding him. Him on the next video. Glad you enjoyed me play Kirby's Extra Epic Yarn. It's been a while since I played this game now. I only got like two of these this one and the uh, original Wii of it. On my last channel, Rex Martinez, I only had to do like an art copy of it. And you could just type down Rex Martinez. This Kirby's Epic Yarn, it's where we warp your time. And it's actually pretty interesting to notice how this game exists to be fun for most kids in younger ages of 10 or 20 year old men like me playing this game are meant for little toddlers. 
And yeah, that's all I, that's all I can say for now. This is a pretty good game. Let's treat the animation, storyline simple, and music pretty nice, so see you then.